we appeal to our leaders to uphold the letter and the spirit of the constitution of Papua New Guinea and protect the family as the basic foundation of our society. We are reminded today by the words from the opening statement of our national constitution that our sovereign nation is established under the guiding hand of God. And by virtue of that authority, that all power belong to the people acting through their duly elected representatives, that respect for dignity of the individual and community interdependence are basic principles of our society, that we shall guard with our lives our national identity, integrity and self-respect. As a mother, I am very concerned about the safety of our women, girls and young children. According to the Mama law, we have the right to be protected against all forms of violence that is affecting our families in PNG today. On the same note, we call upon the government and all the elected leaders to put the interest of the nation first and address the issue of violence before it cripples our nation. We need to partner with leaders who believe in ending violence against women and girls. We need to unite our voices in a common, consistent, loud and disruptive message to demand and secure change today. We believe in God's eternal law of love and respect for our neighbors. As faith leaders, we stand to share our support for the rule of law and respect for the democratic process by which our faithful citizens are free to exercise their right to elect leaders of their choice. We pray for respect for the democratic process to give our young people a chance to dream their dreams of prosperity, hope, and happiness. May God bless Papua New Guinea.